Our quiz for today involves three spring scales, and they're being hung on this rail system. I have a one kilogram mass right here. The one kilogram mass is missing that metal part, the hook that came out, but I've replaced it with a piece of string. I'm gonna hook it onto this uh, piece of balsa wood, which is very, very, very light. Let's say that it'll make up for the little extra um, that this mass had lost. So let's call this one kilogram, this whole thing together. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hook this right on to the three spring scales. We might call this being in parallel, side by side. And our question for today simply asks, what will each scale read? I'm gonna hold the quiz up for you right now so you can take a look. As always, please mark your confidence and then put the reasoning behind whatever you're putting. All right, when I hook this on here, and uh, we say this is a kilogram mass, and a kilogram with gravity pulling down, because spring scales read in newtons, we should end up having one kilogram times 9.8, which is about 9.8 newtons. You can call it roughly about 10. The answer that we often get is that the scales will all read the same, and that makes a lot of sense. Imagine if we were each hanging on this bar system and holding something up. If a friend was also holding it and also this friend was helping, you would think that all of you together would be holding up that one thing. So each one of you would be holding up a third of the thing. So if we had about 10 Newtons or 9.8 or something like that, you might expect that each spring scale would read about 3.3. And that is a wonderful way to think of this, theoretically. But in reality, let me show you what really happens. If I put this on like this, now you can see that this bar is going at an angle. In this case, I think you can see that this spring scale is gonna be reaching, stretching a little bit more than this one over here. So if we saw it in this configuration, maybe a better system would be to say, well, I don't know exactly what they are. I don't know if they're all reading the same thing at this point, but I can say if I added this scale to this scale to this scale, they should read about 9.8, 9.9, 9, 10, something like that, okay? And that's what's happening. This scale is stretched, it reads four. This one reads a little bit more than four. This one reads about three and a half, and this one reads uh, about two and a half, something like that. So. Uh, a better thing to say is they all have to add up. The, the force going down has to equal the force going up for things that are not accelerating. So that's your quiz for today.